these for what the police provide, right? The service they provide, right? Keeping the streets safe. They're getting paid peanuts. Now, in an area like Northampton, yeah. Obviously, things ain't that bad in Northampton or whatever, in it, yeah. But you know what? That's on the surface, you know. Just because there ain't like me, like I automatically think, oh, if an area hasn't got a gang, that means it's a nice area, in it, yeah. But there might still be a lot of people. Well, there is a lot of people drug dealing around here, or whatever, in it, like just selling weed and shit, in it, yeah. But the police might have still put up a lot of bullshit around here, or whatever, in it, yeah. But it's not, it's not a dangerous area, in it. So maybe in an area like Northampton. Yeah, they don't have much to deal with or nothing like that. And yeah, like, you know. But in areas like London, they're getting paid peanuts. Bro, they're dealing with some serious... Nah, bro, listen, some of the men that they have to go and arrest and that, they, they ain't getting paid enough. Literally working for peanuts. It literally, that's what I'm saying, like, these police, it's for the love of the job. Yeah, it's, if it's for money, yeah, they're in the wrong place. Yeah, them man, they are in the wrong place, yeah. If it's for the money, yeah. Go and fucking um, work as an electrician. Become a fucking electrician, yeah. You'll earn more money as an electrician. You'll be happier. Yeah? You'll be safe right now, yeah. Rather than risking your life, yeah, risking getting stabbed or whatever, innit. Go and have to arrest some crazy man or whatever, innit. Yeah? I see a video with a... a, a um, See, that's what I mean. These people, they don't share these videos, yeah? The police officers, right, wanted to stop, um, what you call it? Wanted to stop a man in a, in, a, in a van, a black man in a white van, yeah? They stopped him, I think because his tail light or something like that was out, yeah? Or they wanted to check for insurance because it flagged up with no insurance, yeah? Whatever the stop was for, was a minor compared to what was about to happen. The man, black man, yeah, backed out a machete and chopped the policeman in his neck because he was trying to get away and the police were trying to detain him, yeah? Black people don't... I'm not saying black people, but these people who are on this Black Lives Matter movement, they don't share those videos, yeah? I want to see them share those videos. I want to see them pussy holes underneath the comment section because I know they're not going to be there. I know they're not going to be there, yeah? But... They're, they're, they're there under the videos where the black where the police officers are tasering, man, innit? But why man getting tasered? Man are getting tasered because man are trying to stand up and fight the police. Yeah? This is the shit that the police have to deal with. For the most part, the police's job probably ain't that difficult, yeah? For the most part, just have to deal with mouthy people, that's it. But there was a guy yeah he cut a woman's head off yeah in edmonton yeah he didn't hand himself in or nothing like that the police had to fucking jump in the back garden and arrest him he broke one of the police officers arms it took about four or five of him to man that was fucking madness man i remember that day i was in edmonton and there was a helicopter in the sky and yeah man fucking killed a woman the woman who used to have a, um, a cafe, I used to walk past it, I never knew who owned it or nothing. It was only when the person died. Oh, shit, she owned that cafe, yeah? Police have to go and deal with some maniacs. You're a maniac if you climb into an old... I don't give a fuck whose garden you climb into. You're a maniac if you climb into someone's garden and you chop their head off. All because, apparently, because he, he, he was mad, didn't it? Yeah? He said something like the pigeons, the birds, were, were, were teasing him and taking the piss out of him. That's why he turned mad, you know. This is what weed does to man, you know. Yeah. Might have to deal with fucking drug dealers and that. That's the thing. The police must be pissed off. You know that man made that video, um, is he an honest cop, is he a racist or is he an honest cop? And I was saying that the police officers are not stupid. When they see young black guys, right, that are not from their area, they know, okay, they can observe, okay, this young black guy is not from Cambridgeshire or whatever, isn't it? Yeah? maybe he's a potentially a drug dealer or whatever. Isn't it? 
they must get pissed off, right? There's certain areas, right, outside of London, right? They're not bad areas or nothing like that, right? They got every area's got a little drug problem. There's always gonna be crackheads everywhere, innit? You know, no matter where you go in it, yeah. But they must get pissed off when Londoners come up from London, right? And they go out there selling drugs. They must get pissed off. So yeah, they have to do all that bullshit as well, man. Yeah, nice one, bro. Nice, nice one, brother. Nice one, nice one, nice one. Yeah. And obviously, like, I ain't going to say that in, that I think he was honest and I don't think that. But yeah, I truly believe he was just being honest. Yeah? And my man my man was being an honest policeman, isn't it? He blatantly said, you know, a, young, a lot of um, young black guys come up from London to do drugs in this area. Yeah, he's not stupid, fam. He got, he's a policeman. He's worked in that area for a long time. He's patterned up the whole place, yeah? He knows what certain types of people look like and whatever in it, yeah? He knows, yeah, that there's certain man in the car, potentially, they could be a old man trapping. Now, I listened to the way the guy spoke. I don't think that Ute's a road man, yeah? I don't think he's street like that, yeah? So him personally, the young black guy in the car, he probably weren't a road man. He probably weren't a shot. Up. He might have all been up there for uni. I can't remember what he was up there for, innit? Yeah. But him himself, that you there probably ain't a shot. Up, yeah. More than likely. Yeah? He don't sound like a road man to me. Innit? Yeah? So yeah, maybe the policeman did get it wrong. Yeah. But he knows, all right, boom. This was one time I did get it wrong, but all them other times I was right. Yeah. And if the policeman was always getting it wrong, yeah, imagine the last 10 stops that he made, right? The man them in the car, whatever, in it, or the last 10 black men that they um, arrested, right? Were all from London selling drugs. Sorry. If the last, um, <sighs> just a sec. If, if the last 10 people that he stopped, right, were not drug dealers, right? He wouldn't have that impression that young black guys come up from London and are selling drugs or whatever, innit? Yeah? So, yeah, he wouldn't be under that illusion. But probably the last 10 men that he stopped and searched or arrested or whatever, all from London selling drugs, oh, okay, every black man who they see driving a, a, a car or whatever, innit? Yeah, who looks a certain way probably is a drug dealer, innit? Yeah, you can't blame the police for that, that, that stigma. Yeah. Black people made other black people look like that, right? As I said, yeah, David Cameron is not dressing up like a jewel artist and going and stabbing and shooting no one on the street. Black people are stabbing and shooting people on the street. 